what is up guys welcome back to another video in this video i'm going to show you how you can scrape any website and get contact details from that website using make.com let's get started i've created a google spreadsheet and renamed it to scraping emails shit and here i have two columns one for the domain and one for the email here i have one website for a real estate agency in miami so this is a website and we're going to try and scrape all the text from this website we're going to, also to extract an email address and then add it to this column right here across the domain of the website the first module i'll add right here is a search row module here i will search for spreadsheet our spreadsheet is called scraping email sheet and then the sheet name is sheet one and then i'm going to return a maximum of one row and then click on ok so now when we run our module you can see we are getting our website over here now to scrape all the data from the website i'm going to search for http and then click on make a request module for the url i'm going to add our domain right here whether it's going to be get the body type we're going to choose raw and for the content type we're going to choose json and then click on OK. Now let us run automation and see if it's going to scrape all the data on our website. So you can see over here it shows a success and, this is, and the status code was 200. That means it was a success. And our file size is really huge. And then the data of our website here is all the data on our website. So you can scroll right here down below. You can see all the HTML on our website. The, all these is unreadable text. Now to convert the HTML to text, I'll click on text poser below right here and then click on HTML to text and add it to automation. And then here I'll add our data and then click on OK. And now let's see if we're going to convert our long data right here into readable text. To do that, I'll just run automation and click on run anyway. You can see it's creeping our website and it, our text has been converted into readable text. Now when we click on text right here, you can see it's more readable than what we had previously. Even there are no HTML tags, we're just getting links. We're also getting a lot of information about condos and location of the condos, and then the links to the pages of the site. We're getting all that data right here. So this is readable text, unlike what we had previously over here, which was just a bunch of HTML. So we removed all this HTML and converted, uh, and converted it to readable text right here. To extract contact details from our text, I'll click on text browser again. And this time around, we're going to click on the match button module. And then on the text browser module, on the text, we're going to add our text right here. And now for the pattern, we're going to add a regular expression to extract emails from the text right here. I'm using ChatGPT to ask it to give us a regular expression that defines, that captures the username and captures the domain name and it gave us these regular expression right here so this is the regular expression that we're going to use so i'm going to copy it and then paste it right here and then click on ok now to see if it is going to extract an email from our text i'll click on run once and then click on run anyway it scraped our website converted it into text and then here it scraped our email and the first part of our email and the domain name of our website with our email over here we can update our row with the email address now to do that i'll add a google spreadsheet and then here i'll search for updated row click on our spreadsheet that we'd like to update the sheet name is going to be sheet one for the row number we're going to add the row number right here for the domain we do not want to update our domain we have our domain right here we are only updating the email so i'll update our email with the email over here and then click on ok let us see if it's going to get our domain scrape it convert it into text and then here get our email and then update our email to our google spreadsheet over here now to do that i'll run the automation once and you can see it's got our website this is a link of our website it scraped it with this long data over here and then converted the data into text 
using this module this is the tag that we're getting and then we are matching the pattern of an email using the regular expression that we copied from ChatGPT. that regular expression we're getting the email the first part of our email and the domain of our website and then over here we are updating our raw with our email that we extracted over here now when we go to our spreadsheet you can see we are updating our row with our email address over here so you can have a list of domains on a google spreadsheet like this one and if you're looking to get their email addresses you can set up this automation on make.com that gets the websites scrapes the websites at data converts the data into text and then using the regular expression that we added right here from ChatGPT, we can get the contact details from those websites and update them to our google spreadsheet similar to what we did right here and now we can go ahead and use these email addresses in our cold outreach campaigns so this is a simple automation that you can set up right now on make.com and scrape any website and get the contact details from those websites after you have the contact details you can update the google spreadsheet with the contact details associated with our website or domain and we are doing that by setting up this automation on make.com now if you have an automation in mind or a system that you'd like for me to set up just comment down below in the comment section if i land on your comment and i find it intriguing i'll come back on a future video showing you how to set up the automation from scratch but for now thank you for watching and i'll see you in the next video goodbye